Are you who you need to be? Hey guys, happy Friday. Welcome back to Fearless Fridays. Today is Friday, June 28th. This is episode 35 of Fearless Fridays. As always, I welcome you to the show. If this is your first time watching, welcome to all my first timers. If you are a repeat watcher, thank you so much for watching and uh, tuning in again. So listen, there is a question that has been, well, a phrase rather, that has been kind of knocking around in my brain for the past couple of weeks past few weeks and I'm sure you've heard the phrase before the phrase is in order to get something you've never had you have to do something you've never done and I think it's so true I think it can apply to so many different things so many aspects um, of our lives uh, sometimes we do the same things over and over and over again and we wonder why we're not getting the results that we want and it's because you might just need to do something different but as I think about that phrase, it, as I thought about that phrase, it kind of morphed into a new thought. And that thought is, in order to get something you've never had, you might need to become someone you've never been. Let me say that again. In order to get something you've never had, you may need to become someone you've never been. You know, we're going into the summer and so many people have summer plans and summer goals and we're setting our goals for the rest of the year. Um, for the next two, five, 10 years, we have all of these things that we want to do and we make lists of the steps that we need to take and all the micro goals that we need to achieve in order to get to the goal um, of whatever it is that we're trying to do. And you know, that's great. You have your steps, you have your plan, you know what you're gonna do, but sometimes we forget that the goal that we're trying to attain might require us to be someone different. It might require us to be different in a way than what we already are. I'm not saying you have to completely throw yourself out the window, throw your personality out the window, throw everything you are, everything you believe, everything you set your life on out the window. That's not what I'm saying. But you may need to take on some new character traits in order to get to where you're trying to go. If you are a naturally shy, quiet, reserved person, somebody who just lays back and lets things happen, in order to get to where you're trying to go, in order Order to level up you might need to become a little bit bolder you might need to become someone who speaks out who speaks out clearly and says what you need and, and asks boldly for what you want you might need to become someone who has just decided to shoot their shot that might be what it is you might just need to become someone who decides to shoot their shot and on the other hand, if you are a person who is naturally bold, if you naturally go after everything that you want un unapologetically and you just go for it, in order to level up, in order to get to the next level, you might need to take on some more reserved characteristics. You might need to be a person or you might, you might need to become someone who thinks a little longer about every step that you take and every move that you make and everything that you say. You might need to take on some new characteristics in order to get to where you're trying to go in order to achieve that goal. And like I said, this doesn't mean completely changing everything about yourself, but this does mean looking at yourself, knowing yourself, analyzing yourself, analyzing your actions and the way you tend to do things and looking at the goal and the vision and the plan that you have and figuring out does the goal, does the end goal require something different of me? something new of me? Does it require a characteristic that I don't necessarily have? Does it require a characteristic that I don't embrace? Does it require something new of me? So this is what I want you to think about this week. In order to get something you've never had, you might need to become someone you've never been. In order to level up, you might need to Look at some of your characteristics and decide, okay, this isn't necessarily deserve, uh, serving the vision. I need to do something different. I need to conduct myself slightly differently. I need to be a little bolder or I need to be a little more reserved. I need to shoot my shot or I need to wait my turn. It just depends on what you're going for. But really, honestly, look at yourself and be mindful, be aware of how you naturally are and who you naturally are. And then look at the goal. And if something about who you are is not serving the end goal, maybe you can adjust just a little bit in order to get there, in order 
to achieve what to, what you want to achieve, you might need to just take on some new characteristics. You might need to just become someone you've never been. And you never know when you get to that goal, who you have become might serve that end vision better. So in order to serve the vision, you gotta be who you need to be in order to serve the vision. And if you're not already walking in those characteristics, if you're not already taking on those characteristics, um, taking on those character traits, then it might take you a little bit longer to get there because God just might be like, you know what, she's not ready. I need her to be bold and she's not bold. Or I need her to be more mindful and she's not mindful. Or I need her to be more careful and she's not careful. Or I need her to shoot her shot and she has not learned how to shoot her shot yet. <laughs> so think about it. Think about it. In order to get something you've never had, you might need to become someone you've never been. That has been Fearless Fridays for this week. So listen. I'm going to be taking a little summer hiatus because I have some things that I'm going to be working on. I have some things that I'm working on uh, for the fall. Uh, if you follow me on social media, you may know that um, I recently produced my first short film and it's festival season. So I'm going to be submitting it to a lot of festivals. Um, I've already been accepted to one festival, so I'm very excited about that. So in order for me to fully put myself into festival season and fully prepare myself for what I'm preparing for you, I need to take a little break. So I'm going to take about a six week hiatus. This will be the final episode of Fearless Fridays. And then we're going to go about six weeks before we have another episode. Um, but don't you worry, this is episode 35. So that means you have 35 episodes to binge. And I hope you will do so. Um, as always, if you have comments or questions, feel free to shoot me those things in my inbox, Facebook, IGTV, Twitter, whatever it is. Shoot me a question. Uh, subscribe on YouTube. Follow me on Instagram follow me on Twitter, do all of those things. And uh, as always, fear is stupid, get out in the world, live, love, go, do, be. Remember, in order to get something you've never had, you might need to become someone you've never been. So I hope you follow me. I hope you'll stay tuned and I will see you later this summer. Happy Friday and happy summer. <laughs>